It has been a hot topic across most of the upper Midwest, whether or not we should continue to spring forward and fall back or if we should pick just one time and stick with it all year long. So let's look at the debate. Let's see what we should do. Now I broke this down if we stay just on standard time or just on daylight saving time. For the, so the, for the first one here, this is standard time. If we just stayed on standard time all year long, the winter would stay the same. We would still have those early sunsets in the winter at about 430 in the month of December. The issue then would be in the summer months, we would have have our sunsets before 8 p.m. And fun fact here, we would not have one sunset after 8 p.m. And right now, with us springing forward and falling back, we have 34% of our sunsets in Rochester happen after 8 p.m. So we go from 34% of our sunsets to all of a sudden 0% of our sunsets after 8 p.m. If we look at just daylight saving time all year long, what would change would be the winter. Look at our sunrise at 841 in the morning on December 21st. We are looking at sunrises. So after 8 a.m. from September 25th all the way through February 21st. That means kids are going to school in complete darkness almost early in the mornings. If you're riding the bus at 730, 8 o'clock in the morning, the sun uh, still isn't up. The one nice thing, summer stays the same. You still have that daylight in the evening and you'd have the daylight in the evening here in the winter. We actually wouldn't have a sunset before 5 p.m. So the question is, do you like the sun in the morning or if you like the sun in the evening, we'll let you guys debate.